What we've got going here, we've got the floodgates open on uh, Bull Shoals Dam. We're up to 30,000 CFS, which is about equivalent to 10 generators. Right now, we've got an extremely high amount of water in the, in the lake. We don't normally see that much, and uh, we decided we needed to fish with a minna. And with this bait, looks exactly like a minna. That's a Rebel TD-10, and uh, I just had to figure out a way to get it down. So what I did, I've come up with a regular old rig that we normally use on here on the White River and uh, used a 3 8 ounce weight, tied it on a three-way, tied the bait here and we pitched that thing out there and just let it bounce along the bottom and as that sinker would bounce along the bottom, it'd make this bait work. That weight will bump along the bottom and it makes that bait kick. Drag it along, let it do its thing on the gravel and uh, they beat the fire out of it over the last three or four days. There he is. Woo! I started using this just in the past week. Just got to studying on everything I could think of to uh, get that bait on the bottom and uh, catching fish on it. And I started telling the older folks, oh yeah, yeah, we did that too. We've used it on a rebel crawfish years ago. They put that rebel crawfish on and drag it on the high water and, and they've done really well on it. And it's just something that's faded away and nobody's done it in 35 years.